This is question 8 of the ACT math exam that I'm working through, and this one has to do with testing you on your ability to recognize and use exponents, and together with negative numbers. So, the question reads, what is the value of a cubed times b squared minus a squared plus b when a equals 3 and b equals negative 2? Well, it really is as simple as just plugging in those values for a and b into the equation. So, uh, I will be following the rule for PEMDAS here. So, PEM DAS, which stands for parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Right, so in other words, this is the order one, two, three, four, five, six. You should do an equation. You should first do the parentheses, then turn to the exponents, then do multiplication, division, and finally addition and subtraction in that order. Right? Okay, so if I'm going to uh, plug in some values here. I know that a equals 3, so that's just 3 cubed, right, times b squared. b is negative 2, so b is negative 2 squared, so negative 2 squared, and then minus a squared, and a is 3 again, so 3 squared, and then plus, uh, what, negative 2, because b is negative 2. And I'm going to put parentheses here because it's nice to separate the uh, two signs, plus and minus. Okay, so 3 cubed, 3 times 3 times 3, right? 3 times 3 times 3 equals 27. Okay, so that's 27 times uh, negative 2 squared, so negative 2 times negative 2, which equals 4. Remember, a negative times a negative is a positive, okay? So positive 4, all right? And Again, I'm, I'm looking inside these parentheses, seeing there's a whole number. Well, I can't do anything with that, so I've looked inside my parentheses. I've done my number one duty here. And then I found that uh, I've got an exponent, so I looked, you know, 3, negative 2, 3, negative 2. I can't do anything inside these parentheses. There's no addition or subtraction to be done. So then I turn right to the exponents, which I've just done, right? So uh, here's the exponent uh, uh, 2. So that means that that's squared, so 3 times 3 is 9. And then this just stays the same, right? So uh, I've got 27 times 4 minus 9 plus a negative 2. So I've got to apply PEMDAS. I don't have any exponents left, so now I turn to multiplication and division. Well, I see I've got some multiplication here, so I've got to do that first. Well, let's see. Uh, 27 times 4, 108. So I'll put that here. 108 minus 9 plus a negative 2, all right? Uh, so 108, I can, I can just do this left to right, right? So 108 minus 9 is uh, 99. So that's 99 plus a negative 2, and that's the same thing as 99 minus 2. So that equals 97, and that is answer choice D.